feels really insane. I'm looking down this line and there's Ron Bergman, there's Anthony Daniels, I saw Donal, I saw Ryan Johnson, every single person that, not every single person, but a lot of the people that I love that came together to make this movie and I just feel like I, I hope that I live up to this thing. <laughs> it feels like a big honor and a big responsibility at the same time. You know, I keep reminding myself that I just want to do this thing justice. So many people have loved this for so long and um, man, I hope I don't mess that up. <laughs> You know, I like to think she's brave and smart and a problem solver. And I think that Ryan Johnson has written such an amazing character and I feel so fortunate that I get to be that person. I think they can expect what they always expect from a Star Wars film, which is that Star Wars should, from its inception, it's been something that's been groundbreaking and it hasn't been afraid to take risks. And I think this film is the same thing. You know, I think all the characters are so relatable and they're all going through something really difficult. And it's such a metaphor for life. Like the idea that we are constantly we're constantly bombarded with issues that we don't really truly understand how to deal with or we might be ill-equipped to understand. And these characters are in the same situation, you know? I mean, I know we're in a galaxy far, far away, but really, are we all that different? We're all just trying to figure it out. <laughs> we're all just trying to figure it out. <laughs> you know what's crazy is my family is from Vietnam, and so they were actually living in a different country at the time. They were um, they're refugees from the Vietnam War. And I think Star Wars is something that is passed down in families. My parents were obviously kind of preoccupied during that time, and so um, they they didn't they didn't see Star Wars, and so I wasn't introduced to it as a young child. But I have to say that obviously it's something that's so pervasive in um, pop culture, and it's such an incredible thing. And I think that I've said this before, but the idea that it's been, it's been groundbreaking since since it started, and I hope that we continue that legacy. Um, and I I want to live that way. You know, the idea that. We shouldn't be afraid to take risks. We shouldn't be afraid to try new things. We shouldn't be afraid to put our hope in something that might seem impossible. And I think that's what these films mean. And I, I hope that we're doing it justice. It feels like the same, like tonight, or like, honestly, can you see all these people behind me? Ron Bergman's there, Anthony Daniels is here. Um, I saw Andy Serkis earlier, Laura Dern. Every, it's just, it feels the same. It's like this constant overload of emotion because you just feel so fortunate to be there, but also you need to do the work. Um, so I, I, you know, I want to, I tried to find ways to just be honest in the work and just really concentrate, but also be like, oh, there's BB-8. <laughs> so you have to let yourself have fun, but you also have to remind yourself that there's a job to do. So there's a balance constantly.